Vlogmas, it's day three and I'm vlogging in a bathroom because, well, it's been quite a morning. Um, it took me 35 minutes to get out of bed this morning for my 8 a.m. class just because my room is so cold. But luckily my housing company is coming to fix the heaters today because I don't even know how they work. So hopefully it'll be warm enough that I can actually get out of bed for the rest of the weeks of school. Um, but then I had to get dressed in business casual because I'm working as a tour guide today. And I was gonna do my makeup and straighten my hair, but as you can see, that didn't happen. Um, and then I went to my class, which is just us working on our group project, which is coming together, but still a long ways away from being done. And it has to be presented in a week, and it's very important. It's like 400 points, and that's like the most anything's ever worth. But yeah, I'm having some difficulty with my Vlogmas day two, so if you've watched that, please give this a thumbs up. Um, because if that gets up, it will be a Christmas miracle. As I tweeted, follow me at Catherine. Um, today is so busy that I'm actually not going to be going to a club meeting tonight. I told them I couldn't go because of a group project, but really it's just because I have to catch up on the work I'm supposed to be doing for my group projects. So yeah, and I'll be gone all this weekend and I'm missing a, a lot of stuff. So basically my schedule is as full as ever and at least there's a holiday party tonight for one of the other clubs I'm involved in. So there'll be some good food and treats. And maybe, just maybe, I'll get some footage of that. Although, not many people know I have a YouTube channel, so it might be kind of weird to vlog that. But regardless, I hope you all are having a great day or night. And yeah. Check out my campus. It's mine. I go here. I pay for this. This is what it's like December in LA. This little beeble just finished his first final. Yay. One thumbs up on this video is 1% boost in his grade. Please. Please. Just one for like just, a day can help this child. One, for just one cent a day you can help this kid. <laughs> he also is wearing this tie for the first time. Super soft, feels like a lamb's ear. I like to say that I exposed him to the world of J. Crew. Black Friday. Got you went for, crazy. Got it for 15 bucks. All we've been doing basically is shopping on J. Crew now, so. Yeah, she's a I'm happy about it. Thumbs up for this image. Like, you are so out of my league. But anyway, why are you dressed like that? Because I have work today. Yay! We have work wow. today. Wow! A lot of people, or I've been having conversations with a lot of people lately about like, oh, like, how do you manage to date in college when you have like really different You're schedules? My it's hard to hold you in the frame. This is such a struggle. <laughs> anyway, um, it's actually really not that hard. Like, you saw I was studying and then he finished his final. He like texted me. And so I was like, yo, come to this lounge I was studying in and then just like get a little time together throughout the day. And then we actually overlap in our work schedules. I'm a tour guide and he also works in the admission. Thank you for the squatting. He also works you're, in the admission still center. Me off. So we get to be together through that. Stop! I literally can't. Oh my god, just let me hold it. <laughs> but yeah, it's not that hard because like we work together now and just basically like whenever I finish class, I'll just text him and we meet up. So. It's easy. Just gotta it's find. Easy. Just gotta find gaps in. An easier one. He applies to work in the same office as I do. So hopefully I can get some clips of the AC. Think that'd be weird. Just a little bit. I don't think. I really want to show them Brad. One of my tour guide friends, Brad, is gonna be in one of my videos. He's gonna do a little Disneyland. We're gonna do a Disneyland like pro like hacks um, because we have some tips that are even better than anything we've ever seen before. So we're gonna try to do that video later because we both have annual passes and he works in the mission center as tour guide. So. Yeah, I'll, I'll try to introduce him. He, he really wants to be on this channel. If you've ever seen on my Instagram, he always comments. He's really, I'll try to put some in here. These really long, like fake fan comments. Cause some of you actually leave very genuine comments saying that like you really look up to me. And he just freaking makes fun out of those and like leaves these massive comments that are sometimes believable. Like sometimes my real friends are like off put by him. Cause they're like, uh, this is like a super fan. He's very sassy to say that. He's so sassy. Anyway. I will stop promoting Brad because he doesn't even deserve that praise. 
Look what they sell at the bookstore. This is so USC and so LA. Literally every single athlete is riding one of these things. I heard the greatest um, analogy for what is hoverboards. Uh, these hoverboards are like vaping for transportation. Oh my god. They're really the vaping version of transportation. They're super, like they used to be cool, now they're just yeah, dorky. Dude, I, I vape and I hoverboard. <laughs> they're also just like one step away from Wally, so. I'd also like to give a shout out to this display stand playing band music because this weekend we're going to be Stanford. Whoa! And to gross margins, these are typical that we shoot for. They could be anything. How can Boeing make a lot of money at 18% gross margins if they're they should be shooting for 50. Okay, didn't see you there. My name's Brad. I'm Captain Barry's friend. We'll be embarking on a Disneyland adventure together. Right now, I'm not in my Disneyland environment. I'm currently writing an essay for my cinema class. Hey, Brad. <laughs> what you doing? Hi, Marissa. I'm just working on an essay. This essay is four pages long. It's due tonight at 6 p.m. It's and I never read the book. <laughs> this is so college. <laughs> Definition. You usually we think of tour guides as like the most competent people. Brad is not one of them. No. <laughs> no, Brad is all about competency. If you ever want like a hiring manager, Brad's your guy. He knows. I hire you. Brad can tell you what kind of person you are in like two seconds. That's true too. You're so impressive. I'm going back Team to Brad. Brad. Essay now. Team Brad. Goodbye. Thanks for the appearance, Marissa. Marissa's an avid vloggers watcher, so she knows her stuff. Oh, no, it's video. Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Jackson. Where's your name tag? It's lost. Wow, tour guide of the year. Mm -hmm. What are you working on? How are we doing, fam? <laughs> my preppy style for days. No, this is my vlog channel. Right. It's called. For days. It's called Katha Routings. Katha Routings for days. Do you get it? Yeah, I get it. Okay, good. Sarah! Uh, we're Sarah has her very own YouTube channel, everyone. Oh, oh my I gosh, really please don't. promote it. Please. I'm not gonna promote it. So. Oh gosh, I'll promote it in the down bar. Everyone check for it. Sarah's I, I dance. wonderful. Oh. <laughs> she dabbles. She dabbles. She competitively she dances. Spam sweatshirt. <laughs> what are you working on? What's the day in the life of a tour guide? I'm just writing some follow-ups. I don't want to show you these addresses. So, we write little letters to all of you that visit. So, if you visit, so chance Sarah could write you a note, or Jackson, or me. Personal. And Jackson's researching. Mm-hmm. Science. That's not and science, it's BuzzFeed. Tour guide reasons. This is data yeah. for uh, okay. the interests of the youths that are applying to USC. We're really in Research, touch with market youths, research. All the youths. Outside and thinking. Donald Trump. Well. What do you think about Donald? <laughs> oh Donald. <laughs> Thumbs up if you want Jackson to make his own channel. I'd be very entertained by that. Thumbs up. How do how do we give it virtual thumbs up? No, you just tell him to. Do do the thumbs. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Hey everybody, I'm actually on a mission right now. Um, as you saw, a bunch of clips of me and my tour guides working together. So after my shift on Wednesdays, we have a big staff meeting, and today all the newly hired tour guides and mission ambassadors got their bigs. But Austin is class during that time, so he didn't get to see who his big was. So I have to deliver this little cupcake treat from his big Marissa who you saw in the clip with Brad. So let's go find him. I collided into a skateboarder on my way here and smushed the cupcake. Cause I suck at bike riding. <laughs> I'm sorry. Bruh. It still tastes the same, I promise. Bruh. I'm sorry. She's probably just saying this, like that she crushed it because she like took a bite out of it and needed to make it look like it was. <laughs> that is something I would do. Yeah. But I didn't. I promise it's already on its side. Okay. That's how I got it. Right. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I really feel bad. I literally ran straight into a girl. Because I did the thing you did where you don't move and you just like keep going on your path. And she kept going on her path. I'm sorry. I'm going to my you holiday party. Decisive. At the same time, you also need to be aware. I know. So it's a fine balance. You can't just choose one or the other. Well, aren't you perfect? <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. I gotta read the, did you read the note? Nope. Good. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, bye. Oh, it's, okay, bye.
College essentials, am I right? I'm documenting this. <laughs> what the heck? Do any of you watching this live in homes with heaters like this? Because I don't know what's going on. Turn it on. <laughs> Turn it on. Be careful. Ryan, do it. <laughs> Does that look normal to you? Is this how 19, what century was this built in? 19 something? Early 1900s. Early 1900s. Is this what a house in the early 1900s was supposed to be like? Well, it's toasty now. You can sleep there like that. There's a fire in our house. <laughs> <laughs> Help. If we turn it on, we die? Why, so I can't turn it on in my room? I mean, you can, just be careful. Okay, because I want it to be cold when Talene gets back, because she likes that. All right. Hey, lovelies. So, final clip of the night is me signing off. You can tell if my beats are on, serious work is happening. So, I'm turning the self-control on on my laptop, and I'm going to go to town on some marketing project work because clearly I need to pick up the slack on some stuff. So I'm gonna be doing this till very late at night. Cry me river, I know my life is so hard being in college and getting a great education. So um, this is where I'm gonna leave you. Please, again, if you've made it to this point of the vlog, you should probably just subscribe because if you've made it through 12 or 13 minutes of Cat Throughout, you deserve to just watch every day of Vlogmas ever. So. Please like if you liked anything in this video, and as a comment, I'd like to all, you all to suggest any new Christmas music, Christmas albums, Christmas artists that you think I should check out. I'm always looking to expand my playlist. It hasn't changed since last December, so thanks for that. Put that in the down bar, and I'll see you all next time. Cather out.